for archaeologists, it's a gold mine, with every dig like this one revealing rich new treasures. In fact, the whole area around the Valley of the Kings and Queens is alive with excavations like this. A case of digging under one Egypt to find another two Egypts. Down on the plains, there's a flurry of modern day activity. It begins with the children, like a man here, offering homemade toys of cloth. One pound for this? Yes. And you made this? Yes. How old are you? Uh, Ten. Ten years old? Yes. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, fine. Uh, with so much soft limestone around them, the adult artisans cut blocks of it into workable sizes. Others, like Hussein A. Bukabir, will then sculpt it into works of art. This is just like a copy from uh, the tombs. And people here really are talent, very talent. And they are artists by nature. They inherit this from their father, their grandfather, and it's exactly the same like the ancient Egyptian. Hussein is sculpting a precise replication from one of the tombs. 